Hey guys, so Teddy Fresh is now in stores at Urban Outfitters and I had to come check it out in person because it's so exciting to me. It's not in every location, it's just a few stores and not a lot of styles, but nonetheless, very exciting. So let's go take a look. Celebrity on the vlog Ethan's today. In the house. Where'd he come from? Oh my god. You're probably the most famous person on my vlog. Okay. <laughs> Can I clickbait your name? Yeah, just be like, Ethan, stop by to say what up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> can, we, can we do a thumbnail together? Sure. Okay. Uh, with my biggest fan. It's been a long time coming. For a while now, I've been wanting to clear out our archive of things. I've been, I've just been keeping everything. Like whenever we made a video and we bought props, I always kept everything. And we had in this room like a huge closet behind the wall, so I always just put everything there. And so I felt like it's about time to clear it out, and could be fun to show it for the vlogs. So let's start looking at it. I still have these from the, the hazmat suits. Whenever we, we would watch a video that was like too cringy, it was still hard to handle, we would put these on. The funny thing about this is that you get so hot when you wear it, like insane, that we had to like, I think this is the front because you zip it closed. We had to cut the back so oh. that we would have <laughs> air going in because otherwise you just like, you sweat so much, you can't, you, look, we had to cut the legs open. <laughs> wow. Like, what do we do with this now? I don't know. <laughs> we frame it from the office. Uh, the old flame chair. I saw that, oh my god. <laughs> it was, yeah, it was in the background of a lot of the videos. And then I think I bought another one because it started to deflate. So stuff here, like these are from the, the, what do we call it? The <laughs> what was it called? Hey, what up guys? And then this is the first study Fresh hat. Ethan was wearing it a lot in videos, so that's why it's here. This is the do-rag from the Vape Nation video. Oh, this was pretty iconic. Like, you know, Chex Mix, the company? Mm -hmm. I guess they were friends and they sent us this Papa Bless mix. Oh my god, that's <laughs> awesome! From Chex Mix himself? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> And that was kind of like unheard of because we never had like brands relationships in that way, especially uh -huh. back then. Anything that does this was always funny. <laughs> so <laughs> this is my American flag shirt when I got my um, nationality and I became American. This is terrible. It smells terrible. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, Papa John's was always favorite meme of everybody's. I think fans sent us their actual work uniform. So this is legit? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who was it that we were... I remember shooting something at the... like at a bodega in New York with this. Oh, it, maybe it was a Ryan Johnson thing or like a pickup artist and I think there were like condoms in here. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me see. Oh. What is this? Mm-hmm. <laughs> yep, it's still here. That doctor disrespect. <laughs> Whoops. I think he gave this to us when he came on the podcast. Oh, Elsa dress? Oh my god. The drunk Elsa? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think this is the wig, yeah. And then the, who gave us the matzo man? Was that Posty? May have been Post Malone. I think when we went to one of those rave, <clears throat> to do those rave videos, we made a bunch of, I mean me, I made a bunch of bracelets. What did you say? Please turn the music down. <laughs> uh, vape fuckers. This is not a joke. 
because Ethan was gonna tell on this on stage. Well, he did actually. He said on stage, like, can you turn the music down? Oh, really? Yeah, it was pretty crazy. www.pubberjohns.com. Uh, I think one of our friends was a DJ performing at the EDM mm -hmm. event, and he said he would let us on on stage. And so Ethan was like, "What's one thing I'm gonna say to the microphone?" And <laughs> He thought it would be funny to say, like, can you guys turn it down? It's too loud here. Is that on video? I only got one question! Why is the bass so loud? I mean, seriously, am I the only one? So, I can't remember. There was one video that ended up getting taken down because I think that's the one because the musician. Uh, we were staying to the DJ. We were staying at a hotel together in Vegas, mm -hmm. and so we shot some stuff at the hotel. And then the hotel reached out to us that we don't have permission for that footage. What? Yeah. Just because you shot it. In yeah, there? just like some shots at the room and the the hallway. Oh my that's God, all. That's insane. Mm -hmm. And we had no way. Like we tried like counter and everything, and they they threatened to sue us basically so what, did the they video take your memory card though how could they no the video is already up oh, on youtube so when they saw it they reached out and so eventually the video was taken down mm -hmm. i think sad. that's the one yeah yeah it's so stupid yeah this was a fan made it they're like their idea was like a super long beanie like <laughs> but unfortunately it's too loose so it doesn't actually <laughs> stay on but the idea is cute. This was one of the sweaters Ethan used to wear when I met him. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's I don't know why it's here, <laughs> but I love it. No, that's actually so cute. <laughs> it's so funny. He used to wear all this super vintage stuff and I was like, it's kind of cool. These, we made like, uh, we both wore these. Oh, this oh. was my CEO costume. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Before I was a CEO. I think this was when we went on on, on Vine Street was like making like a documentary about the influencer it was just such a time where there were so many people making supposedly content for kids with like the spider-man and elsa mm -hmm. but it wasn't it was it was weird so we made a lot of videos about that i don't know why we have this i think this was when we first started um doing the podcast we started taking pictures with each guest and framing them oh like actual photos yeah i think that's why i have this one here where was this one taken uh with felix when he was here in la he was like in an airbnb so we went to him and did it there at the at his place so that's this was like outside his spot these are some like meme books Ryan Johnson is, who is a friend of the show. That's actually his book. He's kind of like a pickup artist. So, and also like a, he was a professional soaper, which is like something people don't even know about these days, but that it's like a specific shoe with wheels that they would do stuff like that with. A pro soaper. <laughs> he was such a character. And, and this the ultimate guide to picking up girls with wingman. <laughs> um, well, Nathan for you just because we actually like this show. Maddie B, that's a wrap. <laughs> uh, this was just kind of like a lot of times in the background of our videos. It was just a, a magazine that came out around the time we made our video. So everybody kept showing it to us. Uh, the movement was... A, it's actually from the Nathan For You show. This was a prop, I think, the Bible for Dummies. But I can't remember if we ever actually used it. Papa John's gift card. I'm sure somebody gave that to us at some point. <laughs> These were, oh, dumb products. So yeah, Ethan and I had the, the dumb products video on, on the Daniela channel. So a lot of times I, I would be searching for a while until I felt like I have a good bunch of products and then we would shoot mm -hmm. it. This was one of those for like traveling. It's like an airplane? Yeah. Or... Yeah, you inflate it and then it's like supposed to like rest your head here. Those are amazing, I use that. You actually use it? <laughs> I do, yeah. Do you like it? <laughs> I do. That's funny. <laughs> There's all kinds of stuff here like neck, 
Genie Elite. <laughs> like just the box alone looks so funny to me. <laughs> Look younger without surgery. <laughs> Pimple popping thing, I hate it. So gross. Shittens. It's a um, mitten shaped wiper. <laughs> You gotta go like this and wipe. <laughs> okay, that's so dumb. <laughs> yes. Some of these are like... I think some we did use, some of it we may have not used. This is a hot dog slicer. <laughs> and our pants. <laughs> so funny. Glow in the dark toilet paper. The sham bong. You know how people do beer bong? Mm -hmm. So the sham bong. The oh, champagne. Oh. Yeah, I think we never actually used it, and then this, it has a bag too. <laughs> like you want to show up to a party like this. <laughs> I brought my shampoo. <laughs> the Navage. I still see commercials for this all the time. Wait, what does it? It's smell? supposed to like clean your nose when you're like oh, when you're congested. It it shoots like liquid up your nose. Did you try it? I did, I did not like it. This, a lot of people kept telling me about it. <clears throat> and I think my sister actually bought it Aww. one day for us. Because we were all about the beanies. Mm -hmm. And this is a beanie, like a wine bottle stopper. That is so cute. Yeah, it's, a tiny beanie. it's actually cute. <laughs> How did the whole beanie thing, just because Ethan or you used to wear beanies all the time? Yeah, Ethan used to, and he always had those big beanies. Actually, I just saw one of his old ones here. So when I met Ethan, he had like one of these navy and one red, and they're like so thick and chunky, and he always wore it. And I was like, where did you get these? Because beanies were always super thin and flat the way I knew them. And he apparently got them at the vintage store. So that was always his thing, he always wore it. And, and then when we, when we made Teddy Fresh, one of my things was to try and remake his kind of beanie. So this is one of the first Teddy Fresh samples. But his beanies were even thicker than that. They were crazy big. Um, and then one time he lost one. Oh, and we still have the red one that's framed here. Oh, yeah. So this was the red one. Like, I don't know if you can tell, but you see how thick it is? Yeah. <laughs> Super chunky. So this is the original one he always used to wear? Yeah, and then we made the video where he was like selling it on eBay. Uh-huh. For whatever people will bid. And then the blue one we lost in New York. <laughs> oh. This is a box of a bunch of beanies from when we did the 100 beanie challenge. We went to like downtown here in LA to one of those beanie stars this was like our makeup slash paint this is a white face paint <laughs> that's what you guys use yeah we also at one point used a bunch of old phones i don't even remember what it was for it was some kind of a bit in a video the pikachu stuff I think this is the outfit, yeah. Oh my god! That's the actual vape niche. It was actually Ethan's pajama pants. <laughs> this at one point I, I one time I bought from a vintage store and I wore it in a video and it kind of became my beanie. I still love it, it's so cool. Yeah, it's really cool. It's just some kind of a brand of something. Like I think, I don't know if it's Swedish or... <laughs> it's a hat! <laughs> Isn't it funny how like there's nothing cool about like being Jewish? Like this is what we got. This was definitely a staple at the time. Mm -hmm. I still like it. It's pretty funny. Here's the vape nice shirt oh, that he wore. That's what he wore. Yeah, he wore this too in a lot of stuff. This is a shirt that I made him in Israel because he was a Biggie fan. Did he ever wear it? Yeah, he wore it a lot. <laughs> that's sweet. <laughs> when the Pope was visiting in New York, I think we got this. Or fan art that became merch like this one. This one a lot of people love. Yeah. It's like the Grateful Dead vibe. Was that also fan art? Yeah. That's so cool. The Nation season. And there was one. You look 
liner. I love this one. <laughs> Yeah, it was always like just cool fan art that would, we would end up like reaching out to them and make it official. Oh, this is the can bone outfit. It has like the red sweater and the white polo underneath. Oh, <laughs> that's oh my so God. funny. I forgot about that. Men's diaper. <laughs> Makes sense. Yearbooks? I feel like only that one year. So it's just like all the channels. Oh, that's so, so cool. interesting. Where's the new thing? Uh, Sailage 3. Oh, there it is. Mm -hmm. Jeff the Star, Jeff Dunner. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, here we are. Oh, okay. <laughs> so cool. Pretty random. Kind of cool though. Yeah, kind of cool. I don't think they did that after this year. Oh. Oh, they're both 2016. Yeah, so I think. For your and this is just the 100,000 one. <laughs> That's so cool. The other ones we already took to the office a while ago. Mm -hmm. Just extra, just date and Anila channel. Aw, this is what you guys are watching on right now. Yeah. <laughs> I actually didn't even remember that we got this. Like, I don't know what it's for. It's so cool because it's not like a standard thing, but it's no, fun yeah. too. Wait. Looks like this is a bunch of comments. This has been my whole life on YouTube. It has become so much more comfortable on camera. <laughs> Still working on that. <laughs> they, it's crazy. It must have been like a fan or something. This? I mean like from YouTube that put it together. I don't know, because I feel like they, they don't just do stuff like this, right? Right. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, maybe this is melt. This is uh, happy 2018. I, I feel like every year maybe they were doing something different. Oh, I see. And I think they kind of stopped with all this. Probably oh, too expensive. Mm -hmm. This would be cool to me in the office. Yeah. Oh, well, this is also <laughs> funny. That's not what I thought I was going to see though. This is from when we made the 90s boy brand video and and part of it was that Ethan was gonna go get a spray tan and so <laughs> this was a prop where, where he like he took this <laughs> with you to show the lady like how he wants to look <laughs> hey everybody let me take you back to a magical time back in the 1990s when you could just pick up some binoculars and peep some hot ass cuties fucking babes it doesn't matter what your age Come on with me, let's take it. Go to the beach and frost your tips. Stay in the sun till it looks like you have jaundice. Woo! Play some volleyball with some hot babes. Take them to your mom's place and get the maids. Spray the maids, yeah. Woo! My little brother's watching with binoculars on. It might be wrong, but in the 90s, it's alright. Cause I'm wearing my puka shell necklace tonight. Puka shell necklace tonight. I'm gonna make you jizz. Koozie with me tonight. Um. Doesn't really sound that good. I don't know, man. He's stupid. Maybe I made a mistake doing this. this is kind of Maybe the 90s aren't that dope. I don't know. Fuck. Kind of wasted a lot of time, money, and effort on this. Making you just tonight. The last thing here is my old camera. So this was actually our first camera that we shot all the videos on. That is so cool. Yeah. 
we got so much use out of this one. <laughs> when did you guys, or why did you guys eventually switch to DSLR? Um, I think what it is, is sometimes with this one, lighting was really difficult. So mm -hmm. like if it got a little dark or something, the DSLRs are a lot more bright. I see. And they kind of manage more day and nighttime. Mm-hmm. But then you have to deal with the shakiness. They're more oh, shaky. Oh, right. And heavy. This, uh, yeah, and heavy. And this is like super easy with motion because it has like a better sensor for that. Mm -hmm. So kind of weigh the pros and cons depending on your situation, I guess. She's <laughs> 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 so cute. She's the softest dog. Oh. I could just do this all day. <laughs> She's so good at being pet. She like knows how to do it. Okay. <laughs> I do have meetings. So we brought some of the stuff to the office. This is just the, the start of it. There's some more coming, you guys. There's more? What yeah, you got lots there, of bins actually. What are you looking at? I found something really, really special here. Wow. Here, I'm gonna do my best Brazzo stare. That's intense. That is intense. Can you feel it? Do you feel him? You need to get your Star Trek chair and then put Brazzo all around you. Mm. <laughs> Brazzo could be a Star Trek character. With I, his like powers. Oh yeah, He's yeah. Some sort of like interdimensional being. <laughs> Brazzo. Brazzo! I gotta say, as a fan, I know. Some of this stuff, I can't believe I'm looking at. I know. I like, oh, oh, it's the hat. This is from the water yeah, park video. Yeah, yeah. And did you see the chair? Oh, the flame chair? The flame chair, here it is. The vape Nash bandana. Oh, wow. Oh, yeah. this is important too. The oh, gamer yeah. gunk glasses. Oh, shit. There's some fucking gamer gunk all over this. Ethan put his gunk all over this shit. Wait, this is sticky. They're, sti they're literally sticky, dude. I mean, did you see the video? They yeah. Pretty, oh. Wow, that's, that's, that's authentic gamer gun. That is history. All kinds of glasses. Oh, these are the Vape Nation glasses, aren't they? With the flip. They're, I think. Is that it? They look like that, but I don't think, I don't know. Maybe this was oh, from the second one. This is, maybe these are the fancier, yeah. the Gucci ones. Oh, oh the, 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 the hazmat suit. Yeah. yeah. I, rec I recognize this from Ethan Eler reading hate comments. Ela oh, was, yeah. was wearing this hat. Our, we had an emoji with her wearing that for oh, yeah. a long time on the channel. That ain't, no cowboy, that ain't no cowboy hat, bro. <laughs> no? What is this? It's from uh, someone's birthday party. <laughs> someone's birthday party? A very sweet lady we used to work with. Very sweet lady that we used to work with. Oh, oh, Trisha? It's from Ethan's uh, outfit for her birthday party. Oh, okay. All gotcha. love to Trisha. All love. All love. Sincerely. Ooh, those are fire. What the fuck? I think are those, those are awful. awful. Yeah, that's from the birthday party too. <laughs> How do people wear these? Uh, Excuse sorry. me. Yeah, I know. I love them. You slip them on. Oh my god. Good to go. The breathable. Oh my god. <laughs> breathable. I bet you were hot upstairs right now. Yeah, my feet especially. I was really my concentrating on breathing. my feet temperature. I need to regulate my feet temp. So we found a secret compartment in here. We were trying to figure out what exactly this plaque was for. It says sharing is caring and it has a little cutout for a Sharpie. Oh, yeah. what? And that's why we made some extra for you to share with your fans. Let's see. Thank you, sir. I'm trying to keep it as intact as yeah. possible. So it's like folders. Oh my god, what? Yo. <gasps> Interesting. Damn. These are like this is a rare artifact. I want one. <laughs> Go get him to sign it with the uh, with the red Sharpie. Do it official. Hit me up on eBay. Halo all about eBay. here. We found the secret compartment under this. You did? And it said No, you did sharing not. Sharing is caring. What? <laughs> it had it cut out. For a sharpie that was Wait, in here. What the fuck? Is caring is caring, and that's why we made some extra posters for you to share with your fans. Yeah, what? there's like four posters for fans. 
Oh, that is crazy. I know. And <laughs> we've never seen si this. Since I have you on camera, I mean, you do have a sharp and okay. I am a fan. Maybe right. I could be. Dear. God, I hope this is not going to be too offensive, but it's so funny to me lately. Okay. Um, I, was just, I was just hoping for an autograph, but you I, I, I'm honored. You are serving. <laughs> Hell yeah. And apparently, uh, Sam adds then meow meow. I don't know. I don't even know what that means. As long as you put your name, I'll take it. Ela. I change my autograph every time, so there you go. This is a new original. 2023 nice. autograph. Oh, Thank you so much. <laughs> Hell yeah. Nice guy get Ethan to give me a special message. <laughs> that is pretty cool though, that they gave you these little envelopes too. And like... That's so cool. <laughs> yeah. Because you were showing me this and you're yeah. like, I'm not really sure what this was about. No. <laughs> oh, and it's like a whole thing. Yeah, there's like... <gasps> what? It's like a whole beautiful envelope. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wow. No wonder they stopped. I mean, they spent so much money on yeah. this. Yeah, <laughs> and back then there wasn't, you know, nearly as many big channels, so yeah. they could do all this customized stuff like this. Yeah, this is awesome, though. Cool. Nice. Thank you. Can I have it? I don't know. I just grabbed a sticky. <laughs> I just wanted to feel a flip phone. It's been a while. Yeah. Oh. oh my God! I remember texting? Oh man, I was the T9 king, dude. I can't even tell you. I was gonna say, I was a sidekick gang. You were sidekick? See, I was razor gang. No sidekick. There's one of these. The way I used to play Snake like a pro. Yeah, snake. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Oh man. This look, this the makes Nokia me think of like. Or the Motorola, right. This was like the one. Oh wait, like, no, this one has like. Haha, <laughs> it's got extended ends. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> wow, that's really a throwback. This, this makes me think of like getting stuck on like Jurassic Park Island. And trying to get service to get out. What was the one that like it was similar to this that a lot of people had and they were like legendary for being indestructible? Nokia. Yeah, the Nokia ones. About, yeah. Was it Nokia? Yeah, yeah I guess it was like Nokia. The navy blue and silver ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew so many people that had. Who that are you one. talking to? Doesn't matter. <laughs> no <your> business. <laughs> the power oh, of they like are hanging up on somebody. Like I just miss, I miss like that. being like, you know what? I'll talk. You know, I'll talk to you later. Boom! It feels good. Yeah, yes. slam that shit. <laughs> Don't yeah. Know how to explain. I see my. This is what they took from us. Yeah. Wow. Oh, my iPhone. Just like I see my that. dad pissed off at a client once and just rip it in half. Oh, <laughs> like break it? Like just. Well, that's satisfying too. <laughs> you see that in movies when the spy is yeah. like, oh, I can't be tracked. <laughs> right. <laughs> Stop it. So those phones that I showed in the vlog earlier. Look where they are now. <laughs> they found a new life. Repurposed. By the mad woman. This one is one of yours. <laughs> um, there was another one. This one was one of yours too. <laughs> this is everyone's favorite. We love the pink razor. Love it. My old time favorite phone. Yep. Oh, the walkie talkie was yours. Oh, yeah. Special appearance. This is a and wall that Sam built for a photo shoot we're having right now over here at Daddy Fresh. And this is someone's keyboard. And I was, do recognize I, that. Well, I think I it was taken from someone's desk and it still works <laughs> and it's been on. So I think maybe it could be like typed somewhere. <laughs> oh my God. It photographed so well. I can't wait to see the pictures. Yay. So cool. How, I don't know how you do it, Sam. I don't. Command strips in a prayer. <laughs> Command strips in a prayer. <laughs>